interesting start to the Icky Island DLC. We were captured after I died quite miserably. Or got cut and defeated anyway by some random Mongols. Um, but we've met the local called Tenzo. We know that it's like pirates and raiders who live here. Um, so I'm going to go and try and meet some more allies over on the west coast. And we'll see what trouble we get into on the way there. So a bit of a miserable day currently. Uh, I've changed the background to red because I decided the thumbnails were going to be red. And uh, we can see some... S oh, right here. I am here! The first standoff. Big man. All right. right. Made a bit of a mess there. Spear guy's coming. Your next big man. Eventful start. <laughs> Something going on over there. I'm gonna make my way around on foot. For the most part. I'll try and use all when we get a mob like that, I'll try and use as many tools as possible. Oh, hello, hello. You'll be free soon. I feel like we should change our outfit too. Forget about me. Please, go to the north of the island and look for the cliff with the seagulls. Why would you send me there? I have seen men leap to their death. They say the eagle tribe makes you choose, join or jump. And now they have my son. Say no more. I'll make sure no one has to make that choice again. Okay, little side quest. Nice. Let's hope she finds some s safety. A rumor, which is pretty close by. We'll do that after we've done this main quest. Right, so I know that the, the, the main outfits do have buffs. So resolve gains, ghost weapons, I like to be a bit face first, I guess, is the is a way of putting it. So yeah, like the Sakai clan armor. Can't let them know I'm from Clan Sakai. Oh right, I can only. Can't wear... let them know I'm from Clan Sakai. Can't let them know I'm from Clan Sakai. All right, Jin. Jesus. So yeah, ghost armor is mainly for stealth. I'm not wearing Mongol armor. Traveler's attire is a good neutral one. Clan armor, I don't really like, but... With a good mask, I think it, it does look pretty nice. Hero of Sushima. I don't remember getting this in the main game. Yeah, Tadayori is mostly for ranged. Yeah, the Ronin attire gives us a melee boost. Yeah, it's sort of stealth and melee, which I like. I'm not too bothered about defense because I'm lethal. I don't. I just don't think it's going to be worth it. What should we go for color wise? This is like the this set in particular has the most um uh, color options. We try and find like a nice green sword to go with this. 
We want, really want like a wicker hat type, Ronin type hat, right? God, I mean, I'm immediately fashion souls, fashion <laughs> obsessed in here. Sorry. <laughs> oh, God. Yeah, it's a bit like just like a sword master hat. What we want. I do really like these ones though. Yeah, our friend, I've forgotten his name. Obviously, I've not played the game for so long. That was one of the better boss fights. They are going to get in the way in cutscenes quite a bit though, right? Right, and then we want something green, I guess. Green or white. Oh, 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 yes. <laughs> Beautiful. Okay, we got a bunch of them here. Fish me. Hey, I failed the last standoff. Spear guys were always difficult in the standoffs. Oh, come on, Matt. Did I hear a dog? Stupid dogs. Oh, right, I need to kill him. I like it. Hey! Yeah, I think there must be a low. Yeah, there's like a whole estate here. We're going to play the flute here now, apparently. Yeah, there's still more enemies up there. On our walks, my mother would regale me with funny stories about the cats that roamed the palaces in Kyoto. Okay, I'm tilting. I'm about to get ambushed. Hey. <laughs> I would pepper her with questions, but soon enough. It was time for book and practice. My mother would bring me to the Swordmaster, a gruff country samurai. But I think she wanted something else for me. Charm of Nekoma's Hunt. With the blessing of the feline Kami, throw Kunai at a target during chain assassinations to extend your range. Oh yeah, God. I've forgotten about all this. There's still some enemies nearby, so let's go deal with them. Before we go and meet Tenzo. Hey! Thought you were dead. 
Negio Parsinta, same way. Wait a minute, these aren't Mongols. Hi there. If you find yourself near Zasho Bay, I hear you can take shelter among the ship wreckage that's washed ashore. I'll keep that in mind. Are others gathering there? A few. They're hiding out from the Mongols and trading stories about the Sakai invasion. The Sakai invasion? Hmm. I'd like to hear one of these stories. Another rumor? Make a nice little song with that. Right, it's all the way on the east coast, so we'll keep going with what we were doing. You hear? Yes, you're back from Tsushima. Yeah, probably got sick of all that kneeling about. I wonder if the eagle is like completely independent and why she's not like taking orders from like the main Mongol fleet. Besides the obvious thing of her being weird, right? A weird shaman. I really, I'm really itching for a, a good duel. Someone's had their house burnt down. Oh, burying people. Right, here we go. In from Yarikawa. Didn't think you'd make it. I've got to do something about this weather just for the beginning part of the game here. I like a bit of rain, but... There we go. What happened here? Friends of mine lived on this farm. I hoped they'd join our fight. But those Mongol bastards got to them first. The least they deserve is a proper burial. Won't be long. I'll help you. We don't have to do that. I know. I want to. Hm. Grab the spade. A raider's return. May they find peace in the next life. I didn't take you for a religious man. 
I'm full of surprises. You said you would think about bringing me to your crew. Have you made up your mind? That depends. Is the eagle's poison still affecting you? Yes, but it hasn't slowed me down. Take me to meet your raider friends, and I'll prove I can help you fight back. All right, samurai. We've got a ride ahead of us. Try and keep up. Oh, okay. Where are you taking me? An old raider stronghold. We used it to hide from the samurai. Now it's keeping us safe from the Mongols. You're not worried about taking us samurai to your secret hideaway? Of course I am. But we need every fighting arm we can get. Just watch yourself once we get there. Ever since the Sakai invasion, samurai are slightly less popular than a pit of venomous snakes. The Sakai invasion? The butcher of Iki and his gang thought they could bring a little law and order to our island. <laughs> we showed them, but not before losing a lot of good people. From what I heard, neither side was innocent. There's some truth to that. I've never seen a pretty war. All right, Kage. There's a hidden entrance to the stronghold up ahead. Mongols, they found the entrance. Let's see how good you are with that blade, Samurai. Send your best warrior. Let's do it. No need for stealth. Stealth is for cowards. Marjangui Samurai. I'm like covered in mud. <laughs> I'm literally like covered in clay. <laughs> Whoops. Get this stuff off me. Rolling the leaves. I had such beautiful armor. I swear my arrows are not full. Okay, fair enough. Alright, let's make sure we pilfer as much as we can. We're not getting in this way. That's Fune's doing. Any outsiders find our home, we block the entrance and kill the witnesses. No exceptions. I hope she's more welcoming to invited guests. We'll find out soon enough. Is there another way in? Only by sea. There was a path years ago, before my time. Don't know if it's still there. It's worth a shot. How many samurai has this man murdered? Remember your father's attendant? His throat was opened while he slept. His blood sprayed your tent. Mm. Silence! Jin, you alright? Yes. Sometimes I hear the eagle's voice. Like she can read your mind or something? No. I hear my own thoughts. Things I didn't know I was thinking. But in her voice... I hope it wears off. Yeah, our armor is way too clean and fancy for the mud.
white cliffs. I see why the samurai never found this hideaway of yours. It's the only stronghold on Iki that survived the Sakai invasion. Let's hope that holds for the Mongols. Man. I mean, I, I, this hasn't come out on PC yet, but I hope if you can do a slightly pulled back camera on the PC version, that'd be glorious. The camera is a little too tight, but I understand from a, you know, graphical... No way to cross. There's always a way. Samurai have to say shit like that. Do pirates have to mouth off? Just the clever ones. <sighs> Neat trick. I could use one of those. It was a gift. From a brilliant friend. He passed. I'm sorry to hear that. So is this going to be maybe like our little base of operations? Minor setback. Look for a way around. Welcome to join me. You all right? I'm fine. <laughs> you all right? No! <laughs> Minor setback. Look for a way around. I'm not sure what I was supposed to do there. You're welcome to join me. Yeah. Oh, right. One of our ships. Friends of yours? Wouldn't call them friends. Yes, I knew them. That makes four craft we've lost to the Eagle's warship. I'll get us through here. How did you join up with Fune? We enjoyed the hospitality of the Sakai Inn together. You mean Fort Sakai? Terrible food. But we left with our heads intact. Most of the guests weren't so lucky. My hat would not fit through there. <laughs> Almost there. He is luring you into a den of murderers. They will kill you, just as they killed your father. When we step through that gate, there's no turning back. Everything you do is on my head. Don't make me regret this, Samurai. You don't have to worry about me, Tenzo. Yeah. I promise. Good. Keep that attitude and you'll be fine. Just stay close, keep your sword sheathed, and let me do the talking. Yeah, we're, we're the stranger here. We don't need to be so uptight, right? Here we go. Regardless of our history here and our father and stuff. Tenzo? 
Hunan, you're back. You brought a samurai here? Wait until Hune hears about this. I'll tell her myself. Get back to your posts. I'm watching you, samurai. Let's get you to Fune. Impress her, and the wolves will back off. And if I don't impress her? I've seen her tie men up and leave them to drown at high tide. Even hung one traitor from the mast of her ship for the gulls to eat. But I don't know what she'll do to a samurai. Should I be dressed like more of a samurai rather than a ronin? Let's maybe do that just for a bit of immersion. Um, there's Gosaku's. Stagger damage. We can't wear the Sakai armor. Let's just go for the clan armor. Um, quite like the white and orange. Goes with this sword as well. And then we'll go for a. Maybe go for that. Yeah, I'm down with that. Actually, look like a samurai. <laughs> That's a lot more orange than I'd realised. Those people, more victims of the eagle's poison. Not as lucky as you. Tenzo, you're running out of clean rags. Check the drawers. I have a shirt you can strip down. Let's go, Jin. Finney's waiting. Was that your house? They needed more than me. There's Fune, watching us from her favorite pouch. Tenzo, get your ass up here. Coming, Fune. Remember, make nice. And stole the samurai attitude. Welcome back, Tenzo. I can explain. I hope so, because right now I'm really curious why you brought a samurai into my home. You sent me to find people who can fight. Fight for us, not against us. If I wanted to come for you, you would know it. Jin. It's all right, Tenzo. I want to hear this samurai dig his own grave. I'm here because the Mongols invaded my home, too. And if the Eagle isn't stopped on your shores, she's going to bring her army and her poison to Tsushima. We can defeat the Eagle and save both our homes, but only if we work together. He's your catch, Tenzo. What's your take? Maybe he helps us. Or he's skewered on a Mongol spear. And you get to brag about one more samurai dying on Iki Island. Either way, we've got nothing to lose. You're in, Samurai. I hope you don't get seasick. When the next storm hits, we're taking every boat in this cove and attacking that Mongol warship. Sounds like a good way to lose half your men. Get me aboard that warship, and I can sink it. <laughs> Tenzo, get this fool out of my face. Jin may have a point. We can't get close enough to board the warship, but a Mongol boat from Iki resupplies them every few days. We can take their supply ship and make the delivery ourselves. Tenzo, if you think this can work, you're in charge. I need a dozen men. Jin can be one of them. They're yours. 
The supply ship docks on the northeast side of the island. Look for a small inlet, steep cliffs. I'll meet you there. Fune, it has been a pleasure. Just watch your step, Samurai. Made his return. Our legend grows. Okay, so these I guess these are specific reputation boosts for Icky. Not like the ones in Sushma. Charm of Abundant Reserves. Gain twice as much ammo from pickups. No, I'm okay. Tento has introduced me to Fune and her crew of raiders who are fighting a losing battle against the Eagle tribe. I've convinced them I can help Tenzo turn the tide by destroying a Mongol warship that's been ravaging the coast of Iki. Right. Okay, we've got some side quests. And the main quest is over on the eastern coast. So I guess we could do like a bit of a loop. Uh, get some of these points of interest. Some of these side quests. There's a storyteller here. I imagine there's probably... Ooh! Sarugami armor. Someone at Fune's refuge is telling stories about a cursed set of Sarugami armor. I should find them and listen. They just abandoned me up here. There we go. Let's go talk to the storyteller. Me are everywhere, my lord. Oh, right, that's Watch a mul multiplayer thing. Right. Might do some of that later on. Yeah. Yeah. Hi there. Your bow is only as strong as the boy who made it. Oh, don't bother going to the camp at Nagata Lake. Raided by Mongols. Did any survive? They did. Our monk gave himself as ransom to save us. But without his skills, we're done anyway. If he's still alive, I can bring him back to help you. That will be worth it. The monk towards the south. You won't get far with a dull blade. Fully upgraded. May your steel that armor you. could use a lot more than a spit polish. Oh well. Your armor suits you. Alright, so let's go and see where this quest was. For this cursed armor. He cut off their ears, their noses, then their lips. Such was the cruelty of Black Hand Riku. Cursed bastard. Why worry? Tomorrow's winds will blow tomorrow. Careful, my lord. Riku has a taste for warriors. What are you talking about? Black Hand Riku, the cursed pirate captain who terrorizes Iki Island from beyond the grave. Hmm. Black Hand Riku. Didn't he die at sea years ago? That he did. I am Kashira. I sailed on Riku's bloodstained banner. 
The things I saw still haunt my nightmares. Perhaps you can tell me the tale. Of course. I hope you have a strong stomach. Okay, I'd like some new armor. Black Hand Riku was once the cruelest pirate captain to ever terrorize Iki Island. He carved up his victims piece by piece, always saving a morsel for his loyal companion, a vicious monk. Riku built his armor to honor a brutal Sarugami. This monkey demon inhabited his armor. Its cursed whispers drove Riku to take risks, tempting him with the spoils of battle while pushing him to the brink of ruin. Six years ago, Black Han Riku attacked a refugee ship. Its cargo, children. He threw the young ones overboard. The samurai protector, he skinned alive. His Jesus. crew watched in horror while Riku's monkey fed on the trimmings. Then, mutiny. Black Han Riku's crew plotted to poison their wretched leader. He was stabbed through the chest and blinded by the poison. But. He clung to life, protected by the armor of the Sarugami. Riku set his ship ablaze and fled with his monkey, while his crew burned to death in their fiery tomb. Before he died, Riku hid his Sarugami armor somewhere on Iki Island. Now he haunts the coast. A wrathful spirit who preys on anyone brave or foolish enough to seek the cursed armor of Black Hand Riku. Oh yes, that will be mine. Come on, baboon, show me the way! So you sailed with Black Hand Riku? and plotted his death. Someone had to stop him. And no one has found his Sarugami armor? Many have tried, but they all fell victim to his wrathful spirit. I sense a duel. People say the monkeys of Iki are his eyes and ears. If that's the case, he already knows I'm interested. Where did your ship go down? I don't remember much of that night, but one other crew member survived. Minato. She spends her time hiking Mount Take no Tsuchi, trying to forget the horrors we lived through. Thank you for the tale. Be careful. The monkeys are watching. <laughs> Black sure. Hand Riku sees everything. Sorry, I, I keep pressing uh, the pad because of. Um... Horizon. It's just asking me to leave the, the forge first, so... The refuge, sorry. Are there a few different ways out, or...? I'm not so sure. Right, I'm just going to quickly change the, the colour of this armour. I'm not sure I like this in the white. Yeah, something darker. Yeah, that's better. Yeah, that goes with it perfectly. Yeah, that's better. That someone came into your old path. How is that even possible? Been lost out for years. A pop monkey, a spider, or horse. Or maybe this is just something to cure you. What old path? Tell me.
Right, which way am I supposed if to get out of here? Upon your brig, I will. No, I'm over leveled as it is, apparently. All oh, right, we can just go in the normal way. Wherever oh. you go, your mind remains crippled. Your path leads to madness and death. Okay. Mount Takinos Suji. That's how we pronounce it, right? Okay, it's on the way, right? To the main quest. What we can do is we can sort of make our way across here. Go for a nice trek. Hopefully you run into some Mongols on the way we can take care of, sharpen our skills. Yeah, this armor looks much better in a darker color. So we, I'll have to see how much damage we can take within reason. To make sure it's worthwhile using this. I always like how Jin sticks his right hand out when we when you walk through the long grass, just touching the grass. friend A haiku nice yeah the one thing that I loved about this game in general was that so, like so many of these like points of interest you know while tied into like cultural traditional Japanese stuff the one thing that they were great at doing were was having the main character reflect on his journey right and reflection like is so like it feels really important in in terms of character building like um Yeah, because like, you know, not every point of interest has to involve combat. I wish more games would have the confidence to do stuff like this, right? Sure, there's probably some players who go like, oh, haiku, I don't care about that. And they'll run past and they'll find some people to get in a fight with. But I love stuff. I love these bits. Like all of them, they're just, yeah, they just really help enhance the characters. Uh, like while you're running between missions, right? And yeah. Solace. Okay. So we usually have to pick out lines, right? Wind through a dead tree, unreachable sky. So solace, you need to take solace, so take comfort. No, I don't think wind through a dead tree, no. An unreachable sky. Weeping rivulets. Let's, let's go unreachable sky. Moss clings to a home too harsh. Ribbons suffocating boulders. Or bedrock laid bare to the sun. And these all sound very grim. Let's go to the bedrock. Yet a quiet calm. 
till peace comes at last. Here we go. Only two options. Let's go. Peace comes at last. Unreachable sky. Bedrock laid bare to the sun. Till peace comes at last. Not sure that worked. <laughs> but, yeah. Oh, leave me alone for once. Sit with me a moment. Oh, Yuriko. The strength no. we need is all around us. Thank you, young master. Oh, that was like... I cried my eyes out at that bit with Yuriko in the main game. Huh. A grown man, and you still can barely sit still. A band of solace. Yuriko was, um, she our grand was she our grandmother? Anyway, the elderly woman she who had like dementia, she passed away with us. That was Yuriko, right? Are you a new bird? Probably just taking me to the thing I'm about to go to. We're in Yahata. Oh, archery practice, right? If you can handle yourself in a fight, come here. Are you challenging me? That depends. Are you for or against these Mongols? Against. Then that's all I need to know. We set up archery targets around Iki to train for another samurai invasion. Instead, we got Mongols. If you're looking for practice, shoot an arrow through each lantern as fast as you can. I've shot warriors while riding on horseback. I think I can hit a few lanterns. Hitting them is one thing. Speed is another. When you're ready, grab an arrow. Too slow. Seven seconds. Seven. Going to get himself killed. Okay, charm of concentration. <laughs> Going in the right direction. Okay, I'm happy with that. There's no way I'm getting seven seconds. Bloody hell. My tip? Imagine you're shooting at samurai. <laughs> Thanks for the tip. <laughs> alright, alright, alright. We've got a side quest, some other points of interest. So uh, yeah, let's make our way down there and then we'll try and get this new armor um, as we make our way over to the main quest. So, 
obviously where all this smoke is. Might be another camp then. I would like to just show down and fight everyone, but there's going to be a lot of ranged enemies if it's like a little camp. Yeah. I've got quite a lot of arrows stocked back up though. Don't think it's as heavily guarded as the last place. Oh yeah, stand right up. Here. Right here, big man. Oh, I was close. Oh, come on. Yeah, Dasho. Changing weapons. I'm really close to dying here. Shit. He's got a spear, a shield, and twin swords. Bollocks. Where am I? <laughs> Oh, I was absolutely destroying them then. Damn it. Come on, where's my stand up? 
Who will face me first? Get back here, you Mongols. Some uh, stuff to read over here. I'll loot everything on the way out. Right here. Oh, Matt. Dirty tactics needed. Okay, we're okay. No survivors. Oh, no. Yeah, the weather's gone back to being miserable again, but... Nice work, Kage. Right, there were a lot, plenty of things to pick up, if they're still here. And some Mongol scrolls as well. Make sure we've not mi don't miss them for a bit of lore. We've buried their they've got to bury their dead, right? It's not a uh, trample any graves. Ingune would have taken your son for what he did. It's her law. It applies to everyone. <laughs> well, everyone but her. What do Records. you mean? When her daughter captives uh, the captives. Sentinel's Peak. 
Hansar Khartoun, called the Eagle by her people, offers prayer and comfort to you. We've given you guidance, gifts of wisdom, and chances to redeem your cowardice and bloodshed. When you were lost in the desert at night, we lit your way with a full silver moon and a clear path of white stones. But you chose instead the dark wilderness. You rejected our friendship. Now you are lost to us and to yourselves. There's nowhere else for you to go in this world. Think on your crimes as you complete the final journey to the lower world and face the judgment of your ancestors. These are the words of the eagle. Thanks, our cartoon. Made a mess. Who may clean it up? <clears throat> one of us should have taken our heads. Fine. I'll just do everything. Leave it to old Makibi. Hi, friend. Have you seen him? The ghost of Iki? The ghost of what? The Samurai Phantom hunting bandits. <laughs> Tall as a tree. Eyes of fire. People camped by Kimono Trail saw him just last night. If he's that impressive, I'd like to meet him. Okay. Ghost of Iki Island. Someone's pretending to be us. <laughs> Fair enough. It was uh, down at the entrance, right? There was... Oh, d could I only access it at the beginning? Wow. I think I, yeah. No, 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 it's over here. Oh, was it bamboo? I, I, I saw that bamboo and thought it was a, uh, a record. Always been the weakest gang on the island. But sell out. All right, trade him alone. I'm alone. All right, let's uh, just have a little look in the tent that was at the back. Oh, it's not there, is it? Fair enough, they burnt it all down. All right, Kage. Let's... Uh, have a look down here. Maybe we need to climb, actually. Oh, come on! Thought that... Here we go. of honor a new sword oh yes immortal hope it still carries the scent of wisteria that lives for lifetimes lovely let's give this a try nice bit of pink uh, and wood Doesn't really go with this armor, but I'm not bothered. Yes, I definitely went the wrong way around. What's wrong with you? Looks like you've seen a ghost. Last night, there were blue glowing lights out in the water. Like a pack of Onibi. 
Right. Okay. Um, yeah, we could go and see who this mystery ghost is, and obviously we want to get to this legend as well. Yeah, we'll go on horseback. I can see a golden bird over there. Maybe? Might be a normal bird. This sword would probably go nice with some of the Ronin armor colors, right? Yeah, well, that's not Gallop. We can go at a normal speed. He's making noises around here. We're back on the kimono train. In weird hallucination noises. He wasn't supposed to be here. Did you know? Taka brave. At the end. He was always brave. Yeah. Mr. Bear, don't worry about me. Right, here we go. Bear still creeping up on us. It's not letting me talk to him because Ghost the bear. of Iki, they call him. I'll take him over a dozen samurai any day. There we go. The ghost will help us. I hear he killed a thousand Mongols with that old Shimura bastard slung over his shoulder. <clears throat> yes? Those stories, they're not entirely true. Of course they are. You must have heard some good ones about the ghost. I know some rumors. Snap the Mongol Khan like a piece of driftwood. Sounds like him, all right. If you want to help his fight, the ghost of Iki is asking for donations. We leave our <laughs> offerings at his camp. Northeast of where Kidafure village used to stand. If you're taking food, he likes his sake filtered and his millet washed. I'm sure he does. Oh dear. Ronin hat. I hope the ghost hears our prayers. Hearing's one thing. Let's hope he answers them. Okay, not that far away. Look at the lighting on the sun on the sunset here. Good God. Yeah. You're always best off running around at sunset and sunrise, right? Wonder who's been impersonating me.
They didn't look like Mongols over there. Oh, wait a minute. Yeah, they do. Let's go. Show me your skill. Hey. Get ready to be destroyed by my pink sword. Artoi Samurai. Today. Oh god, there's someone left. the wrong stance then. Managed it. Man. I know the particle effects are fairly extreme, but it's glorious, right? You're going to be alright. <sighs> they had me locked up for days in that thing. <sighs> That was good to watch. You're safe now. <laughs> Look at this. Oh, it's so transformative, isn't it? This time of day. So special. This isn't the one we've already been to, is it? No, it might be. Yeah, this is the one we, we finished the last video on. Look at the light cascading here. Crazy. Must be the ghost camp. Every drop. <laughs> A drunken ghost. He was here, maybe watching something. I should wait, see if he comes back. Movement near the camp. Bandits. You must be the ghost. You're about to get captured. Are you stealing sake? <laughs> hmm. More thief than samurai. And these bandits are blind. Don't hit those barrels. Where are you running off to? Better catch up. Time to meet the ghost. <sighs> Is 
just a normal bandit camp. Like, uh, do we have to fight bandits or? Let's see if you left a trail. Tracks. <laughs> Clumsy. All gamblers would. For you, exit to the ghost of Iki. <laughs> Enough. I'm looking for the ghost. You and half the island, but we found him first. This little rat shit owes us a fortune. He owes me more. One day, boy, then we start snipping off toes. So you're the hero everyone's talking about. Oh, oh, oh no, I, I'm not the ghost, but I do work for him. There we were, fighting to save Iki Island, when those dead fox bandits attacked us, took the ghost prisoner. <sighs> Where do they take him? Their camp, just west of here. I've got one day to pay them back. No, stay out of trouble. I will find your master. I have some questions for the ghost of Iki. All right, mate. You're the assistant. Here we go. Can we get him out without killing anyone? Or? Come and fight! Nope. Apparently not. There's a leap Show and me the mic dropped in the view. The ghost. <laughs> oh, A respectful tribute. <laughs> respectful. I should have known you were behind this. I remember. I'm sorry, Lord Sakai. With Mongols everywhere, I, I couldn't take it anymore. Then I heard this icky smuggler was prepping a one-way trip to the mainland. I had to get out. And you didn't say goodbye. You're always so busy. If you were so eager to escape. How did you end up like this? I got caught sneaking aboard the smuggler's ship. When word got out that I was stranded on Iki, some very bad locals hunted me down. Tried to rob me! Did you rob them first? Skimmed profits and Sarasaka never hurt anybody! So you're the most hated man on Iki. Half the island wants you dead, the other half you owe money. Am I close? Lucky guess. That doesn't explain the ghost act. The people here hate me! But as the ghost, I could inspire the locals, rob the lowlifes, and... and... And buy your way to the mainland. Everybody wins! 
I should leave. Let you deal with this mess. Ah, but the ghost wouldn't do that, right? <sighs> Hold still. Uh, mm, arms are still asleep. Wake them up. I'll escort you to the campsite, but that's it. I guess I could have done that piece, really. Oops. Come on, pal. Better he's been captured by the other guys. All right, Ghost of Iki. You're on your own. Wait, wait, wait! You can't leave me here! Everyone on this island is out to get me! What about your recruit? You met Hugo. Is he all right? He nearly lost his head trying to pay your ransom. <sighs> he's just a fisherman. The kid needs me. Help me find Fugu, and I'll be out of your hair, I promise. He was oh, just here. You better be close. We agreed on a meeting place nearby, in case we were split up. What? Lead the way. Why don't you meet in there, Kenji? I thought you only had eyes for Tsushima. What brings you to I came here with my father once, years ago. Never thought I'd return. When I heard something terrible was happening here, I couldn't ignore it. Wish I'd known about those rumors. All I heard was Iki is safe, not a Mongol in sight. This friend of yours. How did you convince him to join your ghost performance? The Eagle Tribe sank the boat I used to get here. I almost drowned, but Fugu pulled me from the sea. I tried to ditch him, but he wouldn't listen. <laughs> he couldn't resist your charms. <laughs> Few can, my lord. Very lush here, right? Overgrown, green. I think we're gonna get ambushed here. lives to fight again hey, enough with the ghost talk Hugo. you can call me kenji my friend here is the ghost oh i see well someone called the viper has a message for the ghost Th that's for me you're in trouble with the viper of hakata bay he's the smuggler i told you about the one with the ship ready to sail for the mainland i tried sneaking on board but he caught me now i owe him a small fortune if i want to keep my head and get off this island then we better meet him and sort this out. You're going to help me? The ghost of Vicky's going to help himself. I want to meet the smuggler who spent the last 20 years evading samurai capture. Oh, wait a minute. How do I get the horse? There we go. <laughs> On, lads. That sunrise. Oh. <laughs> what happened to your horse? Miko? I had to trade him to the Viper as collateral. I hope he's all right. Lord Shimura's been hunting the Viper for years. You're lucky he didn't take one of your hands when you tried to sneak aboard his ship. He was about to chop off other things but i convinced him to save me a seat to the mainland all it took was handing over miko and promising to pay 10 times the asking price the 
going to the cake. You should know, the Viper doesn't like people like us. People like us? You know, tough guys. <laughs> What's so funny? <sighs> Nothing. Well, whatever you do, don't push him. This doesn't have to get ugly. Look at that sunrise. Oh my god. There's something over there. Wait here, Fugu. Yes, go. I mean, Master Kenji. Oh, I sense a jewel. It's me, Kenji. The ghost of Vicky. We're here to see the Viper. Be calm, Kenji. And don't talk too much. Who? Me? Where is my money? You must be the Viper of Hakata Bay. Who is the muscle, Kenji? He's a friend. Jin Sakai. Sakai? Oh. I had a run-in with your father once. Never got the feeling back in my little finger. <laughs> Cannot say I mourned him. My father made enemies, but they're not mine. Good. Old grudges are bad for business. How did this runt recruit a samurai? Kenji said he tried to sneak aboard your ship. He regrets the insult. That's me, stupid, disrespectful Kenji. Now he owes you a small fortune. A big fortune. If you came to negotiate, you are wasting my time. If you're holding out for money, it's going to take Kenji a year to pay you back. That is his problem. And yours. You need payment today to fund your journey. And whether the Mongol invasion, lower Kenji's payment. And we can settle up now. Or wait. And hope he survives long enough to pay you back in full. Hey! <sighs> you have got a smart friend, Kenji. I think we can work something out, Lord Sakai. Those Ego Tribe bastards stole my navigation charts. Maps of every smuggling route between China and Hakata Bay. You need them to reach the mainland. That is right. And if the Mongols break my code, they will learn every weakness in the Shogun's fleet. That sounds very bad. We can recover these charts. If you grant Kenji passage to the mainland. You have yourself a deal. Keep an eye on Kenji. Trouble sticks to him like shit on rice. Alright, uh, come on, Kenji. It's an absolute mission away, this. That could have gone worse. The Viper yeah. trusts us. Now we have to deliver. I think I pulled something when those bandits tied me up. Maybe I should rest up while Hugo helps you rob the Mongols. He's just a fisherman, Kenji. He saved your life. I know. If you want to act like a ghost, stop using people and start thinking how you can help them. You're going to die here. Just like your father. The yeah. Sakai name will vanish from the earth. Your life meant nothing. Stop it. I'm sick of these. Back there with the Viper. I didn't know you were such a smooth talker. <laughs> 
I spent most of my life helping Lord Shimura settle disputes among samurai families. Sounds boring. <laughs> Sometimes, but wield it carefully. The right word strikes deeper than the sharpest blade. I like your horse, Kenji. Right, here we go. More guards than I expected. Maybe I should keep watch. Anything goes wrong, I'll give a signal. Bird call. No, screaming monkey. Shh. Can't even see anyone. Oh, there we go. Misclick. I will just do a face, a standoff if possible. Yes, yeah, I'm it. right here. Sack it. I am a bull. You are my china shop. Oh, that was close. This guy got a spear. Two can play at that game. Are you, a, are you technically a big man? Oi! sword combat. I love it so. <laughs> Is there no one else? Oh yes there is. Can't wait! No mercy. Let's find these charts. They, these things? The Viper's navigation charts. Time to go. Oh, I could have done that stealthily as well. Oh well. Oh, there's a group of them on the outskirts as well. That might be a separate thing. Alright, Kenj, let's get back. Any luck? I've got it. Let's go. The fight took it out of me. 
<laughs> Just in time. Good work. Everything is here. We'll just need a few minutes to check my maps. Then we set sail. What about the people we sent ahead of us? Hmm? Settled on board, but we are at capacity. Have to dump all expendable cargo. There's only room for one more passenger. Ready to set sail, Kenji? When do we leave? Soon. We wait for no one. Reza doing business with you, Lord Sakai. And you? Hmm. Sure you don't want in? I could hide you in one of my sake barrels. It's a tight squeeze, but with a little cooking oil, those narrow hips... Uh... <laughs> I'll pass. I'm not finished here yet. Well... I guess this is goodbye. Keep some of your best sake chill for me. We'll celebrate when this is all over. I'd like that. <laughs> yeah. okay. Love you, Kenj. Forget something, Master? Yeah, my common sense. <sighs> Take my seat on the ship. You earned it. But, Master... Get moving, before I change my mind. I didn't think you had it in you. <laughs> I'll scrape by. Fugu, I didn't like his chances. It's better this way. Besides, you didn't think you'd get rid of me that easily, did you? <laughs> I'm not that lucky. This calls for a drink. To the ghost of Iki. To forgetting all about him. Ah, oh, good on you, Kenji. Fuck, I love this game, man. Oh, I forgot how much I enjoyed it. Ah, oh, charm of perfect landing. Game resolve after successfully performing a safe landing. How do you... How does one do that? Good on you, Kenji. I followed her from the beginning. Right Good on you. Fort Saka. Earlier, when she killed... What's his name? Uh, the fat smuggler who used to run the cove. That's when she made a name for herself and turn the refuge into a place worth calling home. I found her after the summer I left. War took my family. She gave me a new one. I could use more shut -eye. Ship came out of nowhere, fired a huge volley of burning arrows at us. He lost our homes, everything. I'm sorry. Where did this happen? Midway along the western coast. Be careful. The bastards blast anyone they see. Stay safe. Hmm. I'll see what I can do. Wow, we're a long way away. Oh, so that is a jewel. Oh man, <laughs> why did it have to be optional? I really don't like timed dialogue decisions. They make you anxious, as well as you not really knowing what's going to happen. Oh, that was awesome. That was really cool to see Kenji here. That was really random, but you know, cool to see him give up his seat like that. Awesome. I don't know if I, can, if I select replay on Jewel the Viper, I don't know if it changes the state of the quest. I'm not really sure. Oh, that was awesome, right? I'm having an awesome time, guys. I'm having a great time. And uh, let's just change our sword to something a little bit more... ...coordinated. Um, we want, like... Blues and golds, right? Turquoise. Oh, it's got red on it. 
Yeah, let's go with what we just picked. And then we'll hopefully pick up some new armor in the next video. Oh, I'm, I'm, I'm so happy to be back in here, man. I just, I forgot that the the little bit of, like, uh, soul. Not little bit, like all the, the massive amount of soul that the, that the characters have in this game, right? I just really enjoy it. And the combat's just really fun. I don't necessarily enjoy the stealth. If, if I get a chance to just go in swinging my sword, that's that's what I'm going to do. Because it's the most fun, right? Clashing swords, parrying, changing stances. That's the fun stuff. I, 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 the stealth is the stealth. Um, I prefer just the, the sword on sword stuff. All right, we'll pick it up for me next time, guys. Hopefully we'll move on to that. Um, you know, we don't know what quests we're going to run into. Uh, we're, now, we're near something else now, so um, we'll check out a few things along the way and try and help this monk that we got told about as we make our way back over here. We picked up, uh, picking up loads of side quests, um, which is cool. I think this is going to be a bit longer than I expected, to be honest. You know, just because the thing, that how long to beat, said it's like four or five hours. And I'm all, I've already been playing for like three hours. <laughs> All right, yeah, I hope you enjoyed it. Leave me a thumbs up if you did. Just remember, everyone, never trust an on-crate. I'll see you next time.